Women's trivia, we got the very contested 8-9 matchup between Kevin Taylor and Noel Cuevas. Kevin Taylor's on the right in the white v-neck. Noel Cuevas proudly representing his Miami Heat with the Miami Heat colored uh, long sleeve shirt. Noel, you come to us from Puerto Rico, some time spent in Florida. Uh, highlights of your first round regular season, which was not filmed. You didn't know the capital of your own home state, but uh, looking to redeem yourself, maybe get a berth to the Elite Eight. Uh, are you excited for this matchup? Are you nervous? What are your thoughts? No, I'm excited. I'm excited to see what, what we can do here. All right, Kevin, uh, to be honest with you, I don't really remember much about your regular season game. Uh, just an all-around solid performance, nothing that stood out. Uh, you come in as the nine seed, Noel the eight seed. What are you going to have to do to pull off the upset? Um, <laughs> we're just going to have to reach in my back pocket and come up with something, you know? All right. Well, we're going to get this started. All right, let's get this thing going. First question. Which of your teammates' grandfather played quarterback at the University of North Carolina? Do we have to write it or can we just say it? You have to write it and then you'll say it. You gotta do both. About 10 seconds. Looks like Kevin's got his answer locked in. Noel's got his answer. Kevin is the Ninth seed, we'll ask you to present first. What do you have for us? I'm going to say James Baldwin the third. James Baldwin the third. That answer is incorrect. Noel, what do you have? I have Scott Shevler. Scott Shevler, incorrect. Pratt Maynard. Pratt Maynard's grandfather, the quarterback at North Carolina. Second question. Which country's capital is Pretoria? Pretoria? Pretoria. Which country's capital is Pretoria? Couple seconds here. I don't know. Ah, uh, that's okay. We'll start with you this time, Noel. What do you have? Ireland. I have Ireland. Ireland. That is not correct. <laughs> France. France. Come France. On, not correct either. The correct answer is South Africa. Son South of Africa. Son of a gun. All right. Okay. Scoreless through two questions. Question three: Which solo artist? And R and B group collaborated on the hit "One Sweet Day," which was the Billboard number one hit for a record 16 weeks in 1995 and 1996. We're looking for a solo artist and an R and B group collaboration. They created the hit "One Sweet Day," and it was the Billboard number one hit for a record 16 weeks in the mid 90s. You get a point for, that's possible of two points on this question. Wait, so you're looking for one solo artist? A solo artist who collaborated with an R&B group. So we have to get both, the solo artist you can get a point and for the each. R&B group. The R&B group is worth a point, the solo artist is worth a point. Couple seconds here. Noel on the left, Kevin on the right. Noel the left is the eight seed, Kevin the ninth seed. Kevin, looks like you have an answer locked in. What do you got? I have no idea, but I said R. Kelly and Boys to Men. Boys to Men is correct, so that's a point for Kevin. R. Kelly is not correct. Noel, you did not submit an answer. I was going to say R. Kelly too. Oh, well, R. Kelly was not correct. Yeah. He was too busy Woo! going to the bathroom. Uh, Mariah Carey. <laughs> Mariah Carey. Collaborated with Boys to Men. So, Kevin, on the board, it's one nothing. We go to the fourth question. What late 80s, early 90s TV show featured actors Mark Paul Gosselar, Tiffany Amber Thiessen, and Elizabeth Berkley? Mark Paul Gosselar, Tiffany Amber Thiessen, and Elizabeth Berkley. A hit TV show in the late 80s and early 90s. <clears throat> K, 
Kevin on the right with a point, Noel on the left, still looking to get on the board. Looks like they're struggling with this one. We need an answer here. Kevin's got his locked in, Noel scribbling his down. Noel, we'll start with you. <laughs> I got that Sony show. That 70 show, that is incorrect. Kevin. I said cheers. Cheers, incorrect. The correct answer, saved by the bell. Oh, that's Saved by the bell. I've never seen that. Okay, question five. What soccer star recently broke the record for most goals in a European League season? Kevin, we'll start with you. Messi. Lionel Messi, that is correct. Uh, Kaka. Kaka, that is not correct. Yeah. So Kevin, adding to his total, it's 2 nothing. We go to question number 6. Michael Phelps has 14 Olympic gold medals, the most all time. Of American competitors, Mark Spitz and which other athlete are tied for second with 9 gold medals? American? Yes, of which of American competitors who joins Mark Spitz tied for second most gold medals with nine? What sport does he play? That's not a part of the question. Thanks for trying. Uh -huh. Gonna need an answer though here in the next couple seconds. Noel? Uh, you have anything? No. Kevin? Nothing. Carl Lewis is the correct answer. Carl Lewis. Mm. Alright, 2 nothing, Kevin. Question number seven. We're gonna present you with a visual. It's gonna be a logo, and you gotta tell us what the logo represents. Here it is. Both quickly scribbling down. Noel, we'll start with you. I got Wikipedia. Wikipedia, that is correct. Kevin. Wikipedia. Wikipedia. One, on of my best, one of my best friends writing papers when I was in college. Wikipedia is correct. It's three to one. <laughs> Kevin with the lead. Stop. Question number eight. We're going to play you a clip of a song. You get a point for the title and a point for the artist. So up to two possible points. Kevin's leading three to one. And here is. Noel, we're going to need an answer. Uh, what do you got? I got, I want to say for the title. <laughs> want to say. <laughs> I will, yeah. That is not correct. <laughs> I didn't get a uh, title. I said guess train. Train, that is incorrect. The correct answer is Santeria by Sublime. Jeez. Santeria Santa by Sublime. So that's the end of round one. <laughs> Kevin, the nine seed leading Noel, the eight seed, three to one. We'll be back after this with round two of Loon's Trivia.